Today, I'm going to show you a selection of tips to help you get a healthy start to the new year. We all know you should drink lots of water and keep hydrated, but you can make it easier for yourself by filling up a plastic drinking bottle so you can track exactly how much you're consuming. You can prepare it the night before and keep it on your bedside table so you can start drinking the moment you get up. Find out the recommended amount of water you should be drinking and give yourself targets like make sure you drink a litre of water before midday. Regular exercise is important for staying healthy and if you like going for a jog or a workout but haven't got a pocket to put your house key in. You can unthread the top of one of your shoelaces, take your key, thread it through the key ring hole, tuck it in and re-thread your shoelaces. Tie them as normal and your key is nicely secured and you're not going to lose it. If you like having butter or margarine on your toast, we all know it's not that good for you. So as an alternative, you can try using extra virgin organic coconut oil. It's a lot harder than margarine, but when you get used to it, it's okay. It gives your toast a delicious coconut flavour, and it even works well with jam. Make sure you get enough fresh fruit and veg every day. One of the easiest ways is to make a quick soup. Just chop everything up and put it in a pan. I'm adding some boiling water straight from the kettle and putting in a load more veg. Season it with some salt and herbs and leave it to simmer. When it's ready, if you like, you could blend it or serve it as it is. It's really tasty to have with your lunch every day, or before your dinner. You can also add some fresh goodness to a cheap carton of fruit juice. Just tip it into the blender, then add some fruit or veg. I'm adding a pallet of raspberries, and giving it a blend. I'm also going to throw in a banana, and a raw carrot. And you can experiment with kale or other veg too. It's another great way to get some fresh fruit and veg in your diet. A delicious smoothie. And if you've got any left over, you can fill up an empty bottle and store it in the fridge for tomorrow. If you're a subscriber to my YouTube channel, you can make sure you get notified every time I launch a new video by clicking the little notification bell by my subscribe button and ticking the box. If you want to see more of my videos, you can click on the links or take a look at my YouTube channel page. Stay safe, have fun, and as always, thanks for watching.